Hello there everybody, welcome back to another video once again. In this video I'm going to show you how you can easily stream on Twitch uh, for low-end PCs and high-end PCs. So, um, yeah, a lot of people stream on Twitch, uh, Twitch TV, um, and I think it's the most popular um, uh, like streaming platform uh, right now at the moment. So, yeah, it's really good. Let's get into this. So, of course, you're going to stream with OBS if you have a low-end PC. But for the high-end PCs, you can rather uh, choose from OBS or Shadowplay. Shadowplay is much, much um, easier. So, we're going to actually start with OBS. And um, uh, you want to open it up and it will look like this, basically. And on my previous video, I actually showed you how you can record your screen. And I, uh, and I also show you the lowest, uh, the best settings for a low-end PC. So, I'm not going to do that right now. Um, and for the high-end PCs, uh, I'm not going to show you the best settings for this um, because uh, you can uh, whether do it yourself. Uh, I don't have time in this video, but you can uh, whether do it yourself on OBS or wait until I come to Shadowplay and I'll show you how you can stream there. So uh, basically, you uh, just want to come to OBS, like look like this. Now you want to click Settings. You want to go to Broadcast Settings now. Uh, instead of having file output on only, you want to click that and change it to live stream. Um, now I'll say custom for you. Um, I'm going to click on the streaming service and click Twitch. Now, and then you go to the FMS URL. Um, and this is uh, basically uh, the server. So where do you want your uh, stream to be? In which location? In which server location? Basically in Twitch. So uh, pick the one nearest you if you live in any of these, um, uh, for example, Stockholm. Um, yeah, if you're in Europe, take the Europe ones. Um, so we, yeah, I'm just going to take uh, Sweden, all right, because I live here. Um, now I come to this play path stream key. Um, and what this is, is you have to have a, a stream key, basically a key where uh, you put it in, you paste it in right here. Basically, uh, I'm just writing stuff. Uh, it's a code, basically, uh, a key. And if you paste that in, click apply, and start streaming, um, this will uh, it will come to your stream. It will come to your streaming page on Twitch. So it is very important. This is actually the most important thing uh, if you want to stream on from OBS. So we're gonna go into Twitch and we're gonna find the stream key. I'm gonna show you exactly how to get it. So let's do it right now. So right now I am on Twitch TV. Um, now, uh, I just made an account, a random account, um, and we were after a, uh, a stream key. Basically, uh, that is not a, not a part of the video, uh, but if you want to change your language, you scroll down all the way, click language, and then select your language, because a lot of people don't know this, but um, yeah, that's how you do it. Alright, uh, how to find the stream key, you want to click on your account name, go to dashboard right here, click that, and it will load. And it'll open up a page, and here you can you can also start your live uh, broadcasting here, um, and uh, you can select the broadcast language, editing, activity stats, and there we have it, stream key. Want to click that, and show key. Uh, just a little reminder here, or a tip: uh, do not show this to other people because they uh, can use your key, and if they start streaming with that key. Uh, it will come up on your broadcast, so you don't want any people messing around with it. So I'm just this is my this account is just for the video, so click understand. I'm probably gonna blur it out anyway. I don't know. Uh, so I just want to copy this. Click Control C to copy it. Yeah, if it didn't work, just click uh, reset uh, key. So you just want to close that. Go back into OBS, paste this in, and uh, yeah, that's it. And you just want to change the, this. This doesn't really matter. Click, just click apply, then OK. Now, uh, if you want to stream, I did this in my previous video as well. Exactly how you record. Um, you just this is for streaming now. So instead of clicking start recording, just click start streaming. So want to uh, right click on this uh, to add something that you want to stream. So uh, let's go into our channel first of all. Uh, channel right there. Uh, it's gonna load, load. All right. Um, you can change your broadcast settings. Uh, title of this broadcast. All right. Uh, test for a video one, two, three. Uh, and yeah, that game. No, no game. All right. I'm just gonna uh, stream my desktop. So uh, done. Okay. There we go. Now, um, just 
reminder, as I always say, um, uh, the stream and this uh, streaming right here uh, has a little delay, so don't think that it, it, it's not working. It's just a little delay. So uh, you want to add uh, uh, sources and add it to monitor capture. There we go. So it can, you know, stream my monitor. Yeah, one monitor. Uh, capture, mouse cursor, you want anything like that, if you change it. And opacity, if you want it to be fully, um, like, I mean, see the fully screen and everything. Click on that, and then just click OK once you're done. So, and then click Start Streaming. Now it's streaming, and it will come in, in a couple of seconds. If you refresh this page, um, let's see, let's see, alright, there we go. Now it's just loading, loading as you can see right there. Uh, no, okay, it's not streaming. Oh, there we go, live. Um, uh, now it's just loading, loading as you can see right there. And there is my voice, and there we have it. As you can see, this is my desktop on Twitch. If you're not, if you don't believe me, I uh, just click that. Um, uh, I just have to wait. I was like, well, what, why it's not working? Uh, you just have to wait a couple of seconds. Refresh the page. Refresh it. Refresh it. And then just wait a couple of seconds, and then you're done. And as you can see, we're at this point exactly. And this is just loading because of uh, the connection. So that is how you do it, and how to do it with a game. Uh, if you go back into OBS, it will still record it. So if you click delete now, uh, remove, yes, this will come uh, and it will go into black. As you can see, it will be black now. So it will go, uh, we're going to go offline now. Uh, I'm not I'm sorry, we're not going to go offline. Uh, we'll, we're, we are still streaming though, but if you want to have it on a game, like Canada Strike Global Offensive, click OK. Um, I mean, oh, click Add game capture okay and instead of the application um, of uh, the twitch it will have a, uh, an option where it says counter strike global offensive and you take that one you click okay and then start streaming go into the game and it will stream your game so that is how you do it really easy just like how to record your screen but not live so that is that was for the low end PCs or the high end PCs. I don't really know. Uh, if you are um, an expert on OBS, if you have a high end computer, uh, you probably know the settings. You probably didn't know how to stream. So that's how you do it. But now we're gonna move on to uh, the high end PCs. So everybody who has low end PCs, thank you for watching. Or if you want to still want to learn something from this video, keep on watching, and I'll show you how to do it on a high end PC. So uh, yeah, let's do this. So once you've opened up Shadow Play, it will look like this for you now. You just want to click Shadow Play right here, which is next to uh, the login thing. I'm going to click on it, and um, uh, you want to click, instead of manual right there, you want to click Twitch. Um, you just want to click uh, on, on the mode one. You want to go down to Twitch, and it will look like this, basically. Now, uh, you just want to log into your uh, Twitch account, uh, as I said, or log out for me right there. Um, it'll, uh, say say uh, log in. So you just log into your Twitch account, really easy and really simple. And once you've done that, you just want to select and you want to change the quality to the highest one, uh, or to the to which one you want. Uh, take custom if you want to do it on your custom. All you, all you have to do is change the uh, quality. Just click on quality, the um, bar right there. Click on it, change the quality, and you're probably wondering how do I start my uh, broadcast. Um, you want to hold Alt and then just click F8. As I said right there, uh, if you want to stop recording, I just want to click Alt and F8. If you want to uh, pause and resume, uh, F7. As it says, all everything says right there, and, and the FPS counter as well. Um, yeah, everything for you. Uh, there's uh, there's that. So uh, that yeah, that's you do it. Thank you so much for watching. If this helped you out, make sure to drop a like. Uh, if something went wrong or something is like didn't work, uh, make sure to leave a comment in my comment section. Uh, also, if you want 60 FPS, you can do that in the quality. I know a lot of people want to do that. So uh, yeah, uh, if you have any requests about tutorials, you can leave them down as well. Thank you very much, and I'll see you in the next one.